Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica and of course this is my channel. Okay, so in the title of the video you can see that I'm going to be doing the Marie Kondo method. Kind of, sort of. I'm basically trying, not trying, I'm going to get rid of most of my clothes and I'm going to be left with a suitcase of clothes because I'm moving and I just don't need that many things. My closet is a mess. I'll show you guys um, my actual like in-depth with the closet. I was supposed to make this video, honestly, like two months ago. The sun's coming out, so like that's great. I was supposed to make this video like two months ago, but I just didn't. So for the past two months, I haven't been putting my clothes back properly. I've literally just been throwing it in because I'm just like, you're gonna come out anyways. Not a great way to look at things, but here we are. So before I get started, follow me on Instagram right here, Jessica Kuma underscore on TikTok, Jessica Kuma. And yeah, so I'll show you guys my closet and then we'll do this. There's obviously gonna be some parts I'm gonna like fast forward because I'm not gonna like show you guys every article of clothing, but um yeah, I'm finally doing this. This is October 20th. Oh my god, not 23rd, 31st. It's Halloween. Happy Halloween. But yeah, let's let's do this. Okay. Okay, so this is kind of embarrassing. Like, it's honestly a mess. I'm telling you, I've been throw, literally throwing things in here. You would think I'm a basketball player. And then I have this area. This is all, like, gym stuff, which is actually crazy. But, uh, yeah, we're going to go through that. I don't know why this is not going to try to go straight. Okay, so I have this Ikea bag, which I'm going to put all my clothes that I don't want in there. And I'm just going to put it in, like, a clothing donation bin because, honestly... I don't have time to sell them like I sold a few things and this was like back in like March April but for the most part it's just like if it's going it's going and my hair is oh I don't know what's going on guys okay should we start here we should start here we're gonna do some jeans I know the Marie Kondo um method you're supposed to like hold everything see like do you want to keep it or let go with love but I already know that um, I'm only keeping like four pairs of jeans and they're the last four pairs of jeans that I got from Topshop. And, uh, yeah, besides that, the rest are... Adios! Um, I'm also gonna be, I guess, talking a little bit, even though... I don't know, I was gonna make another video where I talk about, like, my move and stuff, and, like, why I'm moving. I love these pants, but honestly, they don't fit well. I got them so long ago from Forever 21 in Montreal, and... To be honest... Ugh. I feel like I should make a Facebook marketplace post because I've been posting ugh, whatever I've been posting so many free things and like I just love like going downstairs and like giving them free things and like oh but it's like I, I don't have time honestly I don't have it's my last day here I don't have time it's like I'm I'm at, like anyways I can't show you guys everything but like I don't know what I was thinking I think you know when you buy things that look good on camera but then you see like you wear it and you're like okay didn't look I mean Looks good online because I got forget that. This is pretty easy so far. There are things that like I only have two things that I'm keeping so far, and they're my two other top shop jeans. This is one of them. Oh, I shouldn't do that. Having worked out in two days, I'm not feeling kind of. I'm not feeling limber, you know. These four are my top shop jeans: two darks, two lights, two capris, two long pants. I'm wearing one right now, and those are the only jeans I'm keeping. Honestly, I don't think I can ever wear skinny jeans again. Like, I'm just so into this, like, you know, that loose look that all my skinny jeans are automatically gone. So right now, this is not difficult. I'm going to keep these pants. Because I feel like I'm going to be in a warm climate, if that, if that gives a little hint. And uh, I feel like I can wear this with, like, a crop top or something. I don't know. Lululemon. I don't like Lululemon aligns. Are these aligns? I can't even tell. I don't like Lululemon pants anymore. Like leggings, some leggings. That was a lie. Let me refresh. I don't like these specific pairs of leggings. Everyone has them, number one, including me. And it's like, ugh, I'm just so over them. I feel like there's better leggings than like the ones that everybody goes for. I don't know why I feel like a if he's saying that but it's the truth my friends always say that these pants are like business pants i like them 
the sun's coming out which is great but another reason why i had to delay this video a bit is because honestly it has been raining for the past like five days like the sun would come out for an hour i'd be doing something else i'm like okay let's get my camera started and then the sun would go down and i would live in like darkness but um yeah these are the tightest pants of jeans that i owe and i will own and i will no longer be wearing them i don't know why i have so many dress pants it's like I've never worked a corporate job in my life and I have more dress pants than somebody who does work a corporate job. It doesn't make sense. We love bodysuits, but only with the thong back, you know? Is that... Can I put that on YouTube? <laughs> I don't know. No, because I have some bodysuits in here and let me... I already know this one. Let's just put in the no pile from now because honestly, I've never worn this once. I actually have worn this for... Um, why do I keep fibbing? I have worn this for um, videos, but literally you can't tell from the bottom because it wasn't like um, done up. I would just like wear it for like the top and then that's it. So was that really a lie? I don't think so because I never publicly worn it. And um, yeah. <laughs> so we're a quarter done. I'm going to split my closet up into fours. One, two, three, four. That would make sense. Quarter complete. That's been easy so far. I feel like these are cute. But honestly, another I think another thing of the Marie Kondo method was like, if you haven't worn it in like, maybe it's a year. Am I making this up? I don't know. If you haven't worn it in like a year, let it go. These are great. I got them from New York. They're just fila like shorts. But honestly, I never wear them. The waistband is way too tight. It like sucks into my body. But I do like this part. But honestly, no. I'm making this really easy for myself. Um, well, I guess I can say it now it doesn't really matter, but I used to work for this company. You're going to see a lot of their sweaters, which I have seen every day. Revita Size. If you're in the GTA era, find a Revita Size. They have the best cold pressed juices, smoothies, acai bowls, so good. And yeah, but that's going to the no pile because I don't need it anymore. I'm definitely going to post an ad on Facebook because honestly, all these hangers, I feel like they can go to someone. I may take a few. I may take a few. But um, yeah. I don't know why I keep my running medals <laughs> in my closet. I feel like I have more, but it's like, why can't I find them? So I love doing races and uh, yeah, that's that. I want this video to be like less than half an hour. Literally never wore this as well. I don't know what I was thinking when I buy things. It's like, I was like, oh, I actually don't know. I can't, I can't, I can't think of what I was thinking about. So that's just also going to go in the no pile. I'm glad there's more no's and yeses right now. Should I show you guys? I should. Don't mind my mattress. I'm getting rid of it today. So that's all the no stuff. And then this is all the yes stuff. So we're doing good. I also have a cold brew with a pump of sugar-free vanilla. Um, this is honestly from yesterday. In the morning, I already had a cup. Well, I had a cappuccino. I don't know. I don't know why I decided to get this in the afternoon. Literally, I had like this much, and then I just have, I'm having the rest of this morning. I'm thinking I'm a little bit I'm okay. Okay, let's continue on, ladies and gentlemen. I feel like I need more like basic stuff because like look at all these. I'm sorry. Look at all these colors like. I need basic stuff. Anyways, tank top, we love. I love how in the beginning of this video I was like, oh, I'm just gonna fast forward some parts because like you guys don't want to see every single thing. But like honestly, who knows? Um, this is kind of difficult. This is what I'm wearing in my Facebook profile. No, <laughs> my Instagram profile picture. And I kind of actually like it, but it is like a no bra shirt, so that's cool. I just got this like a month ago from Vancouver. It's honestly just a white shirt, but winners, my lighting. This is my, I, yeah, I think my first long sleeve white shirt that is basic and I always wear something like this, but not ribbed, you know? I just need more basic stuff. This is cute, even though it's backwards. That's how you know I don't care because I wash most of my stuff backwards and I literally just Put it up. You can still smell the laundry on it. I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna make this video. It'll be fine. <sighs> Anyways, this shirt unfortunately has to go. So, the story behind the shirt. J.K. Just kidding. I got it because this is my. These are my initials. 
But I also got the stain on it that won't leave. The stain has been there for honestly, I sort of got like five years. I washed this sweater probably more than I washed anything else in my closet. And yeah, so I basically mostly just wear it at home. I have made some like reels with it, but obviously it'll just go up to right here. Hee <laughs> hee. But yeah, it's time for it to go because that stain will not go, so it has to go. This is cute, but I don't like it anymore. <laughs> a lot of these things, you will see that I'm just going to be saying no to them easily because like, I don't know, this is kind of like a professional look. It's not that I don't want, I just, do I have to explain myself? No. I was listening to something and they're like, hey, if you say no, it's just no. Like, why do you have to explain yourself? And it's like, honestly, that is the truth. Because if you say, if you explain yourself a lot after no, it's like, are you trying to justify? Like, if you feel no, you feel no. Love this tank top. Sometimes I have a, a two-in-one, I guess. Two-in-one hanger. This was a great dress from Pretty Little Thing. It's obviously beautiful, but the only thing is that it, um, there's a slit. So every time you walk, it like shows your private parts. So I'm like, who made this? Ooh, this dress I love. It's honestly just a black and white dress. Kind of, I was going to say open back, but not really. Well, that, that's back. I think I got this on Fashion Nova. I've had one Fashion Nova order and I don't think I, I've, I've kept anything from it. This was nice though. It's a bodycon dress. Maybe should I keep it? No. If I also if I'm like thinking, oh should I keep it? If it's not a full body, yes, it's a no. Oh, this is a pretty little thing. Maybe I got that in the purple dress together. I don't know, but if you can imagine, goes <laughs> it's just it it's AC <laughs> I can't speak. It's I think the coffee's getting to me. It's asymmetrical. So let's just stop with that. I'm not keeping it. So I've worn this shirt for like a photo shoot and then I did a few reels in them and honestly the straps are always falling like if you could see my outtakes with this shirt it's a mess so I'm like you gotta go. I don't really like this. I got this one. Where is this from? Forever 21. I got these two together. So the one in my Instagram profile and then this. But I don't like the black and gray one. I think it's because this band at the bottom just looks very weird. I like the... Let it flow, you know? Let it be how it's supposed to be. This pink sweater, I'm gonna say adios to it. I actually, um, why did I keep it? Because it was pink and like I thought, I don't know. It also has a stain in it, right there. And I don't know, it's like, it's not like the other stain where that's like color. This is like, it seems like oil or something. Also watched this a thousand times, not going out so, it's gotta go. Woo, we're, we're getting there almost halfway. This I haven't worn as well. Obviously, saw the tag. This is this is Fashion Nova. This is supposed to go around your neck. It's super open back, which I love. And it's, it's like a jumpsuit, basically. I don't know why I haven't worn it yet. You know what? If I haven't worn it, it has to go. Like, I feel like this color would just be so nice. But it's like, I don't know. I've had it for like two since before covid and if i haven't worked okay it's gotta go it's gotta go i just answered my question i'm talking too much about it it's yes or no i can't i still can't tell if this is ugly or not but i don't want it anymore okay oh i love this the lululemon define this is honestly well everybody knows what this looks like it's one of my uh plain outfits i always wear <sighs> I don't know why I'm trying it on right now. I'm just, just looking, just seeing how it, how it all fits again. I literally wore this last month on my trip. Oh. It just gets, this is so not good with jeans. I, I gotta take it off right now. No one can, well. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we're definitely keeping the Define. It's like one of my favorite things from Lululemon, their Define jacket. How many times can I say Define in a minute? <laughs> Define, define, define. <laughs> Joking. Okay. Okay, we're gonna have a little break just because I deserve it. But I also want to talk about something because I was just like laughing about the whole coffee thing and how I have so much energy right now. Yesterday on my Instagram stories, you guys already know, I was talking about how I unlocked like a certain level of sleep quality that I've never experienced before because of my because I added CBD into my life literally just like two weeks ago, two or three weeks ago. And then yes, or two days ago, I took 
Magnesium the Calm. Actually, I'll just show you guys since I have it. Okay, you guys probably seen this like in the, I don't know, maybe grocery stores, department stores, uh, like a CVS or like a Shopper's Drug Mart, depending on where you are. But this Calm, do you guys see that? It's just like Magnesium Citrate. That plus CBD it literally gives me the best sleep I've ever had in my life. Like yesterday I woke up, I was like, this is crazy, literally crazy. This morning too, crazy. And now that I'm adding like coffee into this mix, I am not on earth. That's all I had to say. But honestly though, if you're having trouble sleeping and you're like, cause I was scared of CBD cause I don't smoke weed at all anymore. <laughs> so I'm like, uh, I don't know, CBD is too close to THC, blah, blah, blah. blah. But like the thing is, it's not that I necessarily had sleep problems. Like I would sleep, wake up feeling good, but I wanted to feel great. Okay, breaks over, breaks over. Cause I just realized like I was rambling and this is not that type of video. So like, let's continue on. Oh no. I really, <laughs> as I'm emptying this out, I realized I didn't take a thumbnail in the beginning. Whatever. I'll figure it out. Okay, I got this Calvin Klein thing, which I actually like. I wear that all the time. I seem to be keeping a lot of darker clothing. Hmm. Uh, this is Memories. So, in 2019, when the Raptors won the NBA Finals, me and my brother ordered um, shirts from the official website. And yeah, got my 2019 Finals Toronto Raptors great and that is for memory's sake we got a bodysuit this is very very frisky if I wear this well not if I wear this I do wear this but let's just say you'll never see me wearing this if you know what I mean <laughs> yeah anyways we like that back I think I'm trying to get as much as I can from this side even though I'm like more than halfway oh should have just done that. Should probably bring you guys closer. Actually, I realize I can't because um, am I in the frame? Yeah. It's so hard because I'm so tall, six feet almost. Sun is not really coming out anymore, so I'm just trying to do this the best that I can. I love this sweater. This is my friend's company. It's called Wake the Health Up. Also follow her. She's great. And I love this sweater. This sweater has definitely replaced my JK white sweater. And yeah, it looks like this. So proud of her. Wake the health up. Um, this is a pretty little thing. Yeah. I don't know. I went on like a little rampage when I got this. Haven't worn this either. But I kind of really like it. I think I'm actually going to keep this because it has, I feel like because I'm going to a warmer place, I'll be... I don't know. I'm trying to justify it. If I'm trying to justify it, Jessica, <laughs> you already know. Okay, it's going to the no pile. I don't know why I got two orange, like, this one definitely no, because this didn't even fit me when I got it. Don't know why I kept it. It's so, like, I think those are both the same size. 10? Oh, that's a 10. This is an 8. This is small, like, no, this one I know I'm definitely not keeping. I'm looking at the other one like, oh, it's so nice though. Okay, I'm gonna go try this on actually, see how it looks on camera, and then make my decision. Because this is something I'm actually battling with, like this specific shirt. I pulled it back out. <laughs> okay, what is going on here? Do I like this or do I not? I think I have to go see an actual mirror. I literally just threw it on right now. I kind of do like it. I think the color is just throwing me off. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, I think I'm going to keep it. I kind of like, actually like it. Do a little 3-6 suspend. I don't know. It's so, you can see kind of a lot of lines. I'm wearing a sports bra and then it's like, you know. Guys, I can't, I think I'm just, I'm not going to keep it because first of all, I'm having too much troubles figuring out like if I actually like it, it's giving me like, it's giving me pumpkin vibes, but it's also Halloween. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. 
Yeah, I got this actually thrifting. It was great. I was like, oh, this could be like a nice, like, you know, oversized sweater, maybe like shorts, like, you know, whatever. Kind of even like with the jeans that I'm wearing now. But honestly, no, I'm not going to keep it because I don't really wear it. It's got to go. This video is getting long. <laughs> I'm like looking at the 12, 13 minute mark now, plus I think the 25 from earlier. We am going to cut a lot of things out. So this shirt is bittersweet, but it has to go because it's a shirt that says Cali. Honestly, I haven't worn it. There you go. I got it from Target, which is Target when I was in the States. I actually got it in Cali. And I was like, oh, haha, ha, cool. But literally, I don't know why. I was just, I wasn't thinking. Like, I'll never wear that here. I won't be going back to California for a while. And like, the, definitely not that person. So like, just because I go somewhere, I'm going to wear like your state or city or province or town or whatever on my shirt. Like, no. Besides Toronto, obviously. So, um, actually in Mexico. Because I have this Mexico bag. See this? I just want to... Okay, Humber, this is a college. I went to both campuses. We love education here, but um, do I think there's a hole in the armpit? I know there is actually. I just don't need it anymore. There's a hole in the armpit. Also, some of these things, I'm like, what was I ever thinking? Sorry, not sorry. I think I thought it was so cool when I got this because all these, like, I thought this was, like, hip. Oh, I don't even know. Like, what is this? A Wi-Fi symbol? Cactus? Like, plants? That's, that's a gender, right? I think. Shoes. A little gem. Don't know. I got this from H&M, actually. I don't know why I thought I was so. Sorry, not sorry. It's gotta go. Guys, this is this is a wild part. Like the first half. Oh my god. I have my plant behind me that I'm taking to my parents. Guys, this is my money tree. Meet cash. I actually don't know if it's girl or boy. It is um my tree is non or my plant is non-binary, so they go by no gender, but yeah, this is cash and they are doing great. Treat your plants like your kids and they will blossom. That's very true actually. There's experiment done on it. I don't make the rules up, it's just, it is what it is. It's, this is already stressing me out, but it's fine. This is the area where I know, like up here is a lot of no's, I just know that. Um, so maybe now I'll do like a little fast forward thing because honestly this video has to be less than half an hour. Let's go. Okay guys, sorry, I have to take a little break. <sighs> Let's just say the coffee started running through me. We're all adults here. Human, we're life. For life, it's part of life. Oh my God, I feel so <laughs> You would think that I literally just, <clears throat> I won't say that. There's people paddle, board paddle boarding right now. Should I show you guys? I'll show you guys. I'm not gonna go outside though. And now since I'm moving, you guys can see my full view. This is where I used to live. By the time this is up, I won't live here anymore. Ooh, but you guys can see a little sneak peek here. Okay. Okay, now that we're back from our intermission, we're gonna tackle this. This is the area that I was trying to like, I don't know what I was trying to do. I couldn't escape it because it's right there. So let's just do it. Oh, I should show you guys an update of like the no and yes pile. Once again, let me just separate it properly. 
Oh my god. Okay. Okay, so this is a no pile right here. This is a yes pile. And yes, I have more clothes over there that were in my dryer that I have to actually go through as well. Plus, hopefully you guys can hear me. Plus, I have more clothes in my dryer right now, and I still have one more load of laundry to do. So, I had way too many clothes. I had way too many clothes, and they just weren't necessary. Okay. So, you're going to be loud enough. If I haven't worn a specific workout shirt for a while, it's just going to be go straight to the no. I know I need to get more workout clothes. I feel like I've kind of changed my style. Sometimes you, you, you just want like that big shirt to work out in, especially if you're in your period or something. You don't want like a, a tight, tight shirt. It's too long. This part is going to go by pretty quickly because I'm just like, I know what I like. I know what I've been wearing, I know what I haven't been wearing, so if I don't worry you, goodbye. These are short, you know? These, those are a little too short for me. I don't want that either. I just kind of want to change my whole style with... I just see... Yeah. This is actually going way better than I thought. These leggings, I'm actually going to keep. I like them. They're from this girl that used to live in my building. I'm going super fast right now. This handle that goes with one of my purses. Everybody has like, you know, they have a sports bra. Those, but this is just gonna go. Oh, my surgery bra for my breast augmentation. Don't need it. I used to have my hair in like straight weave kinda. I would always wear um, head ties when like running at the gym and stuff. So I have so many of them. I have a lot of Lululemon ones. If I haven't wore headbands in the past, like, Four years? Why am I gonna keep these? Just because like the little lemon? Like no, Jessica. Yeah, no, I can't imagine myself ever wearing these again. So we're gonna put them in the no pile where they belong. Resistance bands, always great to have. There's so many of them. Yay. Oh no. Wait, did I not know about these? <clears throat> what is going on? I'm actually confused. I have a pair of Lululemon pants that I don't quite remember and I've never worn. How much are they worth? No price. That's cool. Um, I want to try it on, but I'm like, like ugh, maybe later. I'll put it on the... First, oops. First thing is actually going on the side side, so I have to try it on. More Lululemon headbands. Bro, I didn't even know my Lululemon headband phase was this big. Did I buy like 10 at once? Jeez. No. This is kind of nice. I like it. It's, it's tight fitting, so I'll keep that. This video is probably going to end up being like, hopefully around half an hour, but just now I've been filming for over an hour, so I'm like at the point where I'm just done. These are all a lot of shorts and like beach cover-ups. So I'm just gonna keep that because we're gonna be going hint, we're gonna be going to the beach a lot. <laughs> okay guys. I feel like I just need like a two-minute break. Because that, that took a lot out of me. It's so crazy because like one second I was like, yeah, caffeine. The thing is, I get bored really easily. But that was so, that's such a mundane task to do. And now I'm like, my no pile is so big. I have to find a way to transport things multiple times. I'm just like, just thinking about the future, you know. Okay, I'm gonna get up now. <sighs> now we're gonna put all my clothes into my suitcase, the clothes I'm keeping. And then with the note pile, I'll, I'll just figure that out off of camera because it's a lot of things I don't want. Guys, I put my hair up because like it was just getting in the way too much. 
Um, this is gonna be like a little fast forward thing of me putting all the clothes I'm keeping in my suitcase. My suitcase smells like shampoo or like body wash because when I lost the traveling with it, it exploded. So that's great. Um, enjoy. <laughs> I just realized my battery is almost dying, so I'll just come back at the end and show you guys the final result. Result? Result. <laughs> okay guys, these are pretty much all the clothes I'm keeping. I'm going to put a picture of what the pile of the no clothes looks like. I didn't take a picture, but I took it like an Instagram story, so I'm just going to post that here. Honestly, God bless. <laughs> That was a stressful process, but I'm all done. So I'm now going to take a few trips to the donation bin to send my clothes that I don't want anymore. And that's going to be probably about half an hour because I need to take a few trips and then get more reusable bags. Great. So um, thank you so much for watching. This was my alternate Marie Kondo getting rid of my stuff a video. I don't know, but yes. There'll be more videos coming out about like where I'm going, what the plans are, all that kind of jazz. But besides that, I, I'm in a time-sensitive manner in my life and I gotta get the show on the road. So once again, follow me on Instagram right here, JessicaKuma underscore TikTok. I always like, I'm hesitant to like say my TikTok just because like it's just a lot of Instagram stuff. But you know, there's also some like fun stuff in there too. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe and uh, goodbye. <laughs> I like her so much.